Functional Aging Specialist, Lisa Wright from Your Personal Best Training Studio here. I've got a couple of facts for you today on a topic that I think we will hear more about in the future. But first, I have a pop quiz for you. Do you know when the magic from your workouts happens? That is, when your body changes as a result of your workout? If you said after, you get a gold star. Give me a like in the comments below. That's right. It's not during your workouts. Your body gets stronger and more fit between your workouts. That makes your recovery super important. Won't you agree? This seems pretty ironic because boosting workout recovery is one of the least studied aspects of fitness. I think maybe it's because there's so much worry that we're not working out enough, that there's been less concern we're doing too much. But scientists are starting to dive into this topic a lot more now, which is great news. When you work out, especially with weights, you are causing damage to your muscles. When your body repairs that damage, it gets stronger. In this video, I'm going to give you the first and last of nine simple and time-tested recovery tips that can help you make the most of your workouts and the time between them. First tip, getting enough sleep, especially deep sleep, is important. And it might also be why your body spends more time in the deep sleep phase when you work out regularly. Make sure you schedule in enough time each night to get a full seven to eight hours of sleep as often as possible. If you need help with improving your sleep, whether you need to get more of it or improve the quality of the sleep you do get, you need to check out my new ebook called Supercharge Your Sleep. You can get it by following a simple link in the post above as my gift to you. But what else can you do to make the most of your recovery? Please visit my website today for all nine tips. Lastly, tip number nine is probably the most important recovery tip of all. Listen to your body. If you're tired but still want to work out, do something that's not so taxing on your system, like an easy cardio session or even a walk. If you are feeling wiped out or you need a little break, respect that, but make sure to get back to it tomorrow. I hope these tips have been helpful. As always, I'm here if you have questions. Just leave a comment below or drop me a private message. Talk to you again soon. Have a great day.